Hi everyone, I know it's been a long time, but today I decided that I wanted to show you a little thrift haul because I've been slowly but surely restocking my wardrobe since gaining some weight. So I'm excited to show you what I got. Here we go. So first we're gonna start off with this really basic, simple skater dress. So now we have this little shrug situation. It's got really cute pink bows and like little peekaboo detailing. Thumb holes, sorry for my horrible nails. Um, and then on the back, it shows a little skin right here, a little peephole situation. So I think it's pretty cute. Unfortunately, it doesn't fit all that great though. So a little bummed about that, but. Okay, so the final touches are this thrifted necklace. These earrings, headband, little bow, I had to do a, a bun, of course, to fit with the whole ballet core aesthetic. And some rings, very simple rings. Wearing these pants that I thrifted that were originally from Target, they're universal thread. And pairing it with this top by scotch and soda now over this i'll be putting on another thrifted top this one is from old navy originally and i just really liked it because of the material it's kind of like a canvas material and then it's got these pockets which remind me of something that a painter would wear all right, so final look with accessories. I've got these two rings I got from a local jewelry store for like two bucks each. I've got this cicada necklace that I made. These two very simple gold chains that someone gave me. Sorry, I gotta readjust, okay. <laughs> Um, yeah, very simple, but also kind of interesting with the pattern on the shirt and the accessories make it a little different. Oh, and these earrings. I also thrifted these earrings. They're just gold safety pins. And I would wear it with these Adidas. All right, so this is the next outfit. As you can probably tell, I really like menswear. This was thrifted from Buffalo Exchange, but it was originally from H&M. This was from El Train Windsor, just by the brand San Bernini. These are the same universal thread of pants that I was wearing in the other outfit. I've got this cool crystal that I got from the mall. These two rings, this one was also thrifted from Buffalo Exchange, it's a fairy ring. And then this one was, I think, from Forever 21 a long time ago. These, I think, were from Wish, again, a long time ago. Don't shop there anymore, don't approve of it. <laughs> um, yeah, I would probably wear them with these palladiums. This look is a little experimental, but I've been seeing a lot of layering, a lot of like pockets, um, mermaid core type stuff. So I decided to maybe try to fuse them together and see if they can work because the colors kind of go together. But this shirt is from The Limited. I got it at L Train Vintage. These earrings are from H&M. Um, this ring was gifted to me. This ring was from a local jewelry shop. This is an Alex and Annie mermaid bracelet. I, can't, I don't know if you can tell. And then I got this old bracelet from Shein. So this is what the outfit looks like. Um, usually it would be like some sort of netting here, but I don't have that. 
So what I did was I tied a button down around my waist in a similar color to kind of give it that feel and add a layer because I'm also seeing a lot of people use skirts over pants and stuff like that. This is a skirt, so I wasn't sure how that would look, but I don't know. I like the juxtaposition and the different angles. Okay, so this look is a lot more fun than the last ones. Um, I love the art print. It's so colorful and unique. Um, to keep up with the print colors, I chose these earrings. They're really fun out there. I have this necklace that I also thrifted and these squiggly little rings. And these cargo pants are actually from Rainbow. I like the pockets all along the side of the pants and the butt. And I like that it's got a drawstring and an elastic waist because it makes it really comfy. To take it an extra step further, I added this painted up button up, uh, just wrapped it around my waist. It's a little nuts. But I actually really like it. It's not in my comfort zone, but I'm trying to be more experimental nowadays, so I could wear this out. Maybe.